All right, friends, quick video today with Doug Gray. As always, our master of all things rods, reels, and he's also filleted about a million tuna in his lifetime. So uh, Killer Bee Customs, we're gonna look in this video today on how to properly fillet, in this case, a yellowfin tuna. And I'll ask some dumb questions because I'm the resident dum-dum. So uh, start, it off, start us off, Doug. Where do, we, where do we start with this? What do we do? Well, first thing is uh, <clears throat> know a little bit about the bone structure. Bone okay? structure? This is a, ba we got a clap. Oh, because basically when you're playing a fish, you want to get to, you want to get the meat off with no bones. Yes. So basically, you have, uh, all fish have a backbone. Yep. And they have spines that run up and down. Yep. And then they have a rib cage that runs this way. So basically, you have a cross section of the tuna like that. So you have two top loins here on either side, and then two bottom loins on the lower side on the belly side. Two top loins, two bottom loins. Yep. All right, let's, let's, we're gonna start Ooh. right here behind the, behind the peck fin and cut up towards the head. Okay. Right on down that spine. Following the spine. Okay. All the way down. All the way through the tail. So yeah, I can I like to go till I can feel I can feel that center bone there. Okay. Alright, then we're gonna go right here to the lateral line. It was cut right So that line down. is created essentially it's like marked almost for you. Pretty much, yep. Okay. And so now From that and then we're just gonna cut away a little bit of connective tissue in here. And that little one should roll right on out of there. And that one rolls go. right on out of there. And you can you can see it was nice and just all right, nice and tight. We got a few bones in here, so when we finish this this loin up, we'll cut right along these bones, just like this. And you get rid of some of that red meat too. Depending, yeah. Do you yep. the red meat? Ah, uh, some people do. I don't. I'm not a red meat guy. I don't it, believe it, it, it's fair. It's pretty strong and bloody. So okay, we'll cut that away. All right. We'll take the. Uh, Knife number two. Yep. Down through, hold it against the table. So it's like cut it in half and then turn. Yep. Make the L and then you've got your loin. There you got a nice wound and no skin. Okay. Alright. I'll spin it around. That's clean. Like that. That's clean, man. Look at that. That's clean there, Douglas. And you see how light this meat is? Yes. That's because we bled these two of the properly. Right. They have been bled properly. All right, good. Now we're going for the bottom half, right? Right on down. Shallow cut there. Spinning back around. And we'll see if we can roll this one right off as well. Man, that's clean. Look at this rib cage, it's like perfectly like against it. Well, oh, that's good. I didn't miss much. No, you did not. No waste there. You would make mama happy. Well, mama will be happy. Mama is gonna be happy with this meal here, though. This is round. This is round two, and we're gonna actually put that clock on the screen without cutting your fingers off, Doug. We're gonna see how quickly can one uh, fillet what is, uh, you know, I don't know, is a 35-pound yellowfin? Yeah, something like that. Like that. Yeah. like that. Okay, let's see how quickly it can can be done. 35-pound yellowfin. 
All right, the clock is on and go. Okay. Yes, still got it clean. good you know what I'm saying he's very good and that's exactly how you can fillet a yellowfin tuna and in this case how you can do it in uh, was about a minute and 40 seconds really impressive as always make sure you if you ever want a custom rod reel this guy right here killer beat customs he is the man he did all of ours on the speechless we're here at Pirates Cove Marina today it's been an amazing time make sure you join us on a trip this year and until the next time stay salty